It's beautiful. I told you it was perfect. It's just the peace and quiet that I need to finish my new book. David, did you hear that? <gasps> oh my God! It's a good thing I love you. We wouldn't want Susan to go through another episode. Now would we? There's a man in the hall. There's nobody in the hall. Well, we've checked everywhere. There's no sign of a break. There has to be. I saw him. He had to get in here somehow. There's a kid out there kicking the ball. I didn't imagine it. Your creative mind's running loose. My creative mind? Whatever it is you've been experiencing, there's nothing there now. I feel a bit scared here on my own. Susan, I'd like to introduce you to Mr. Peck. He's our gamekeeper. But it's good sense to have someone around. A bit of extra security for the place when I'm away. David called me from the train station, asked me to keep you company, stay by the house tonight. There's something happening in that house. Have you told your husband? He doesn't see anything, he doesn't hear anything. I don't know what with the background. Yeah. Yes. You're nuts! You really are mental! Murdered in our beds, I'll be sure to let you know.